Guys, uh, are you having a good time tonight? Yeah, man. yeah, most yeah. definitely. Exactly. Yeah. It's so important for Sterling to have a night like this where we're, we're, we're outside, you know, bands playing, DJs playing on right now. It's just, it's just perfect. You know, it's exactly what Sterling needs. So we were like, it's, it's a new thing in Sterling, so we thought, oh, we'll go out there, and I'm so glad I came. It's awesome. So yeah. round up the troops, and here we are. <laughs> Hi, my name's Liam Chapman. I'm uh, the York manager. Um, <laughs> Music more than anything yeah. else. Yeah. 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 Something that is, is or should be a breath of fresh air. Yeah, no, yeah, we have definitely, such yeah. a good time tonight. It's so different, but I, we love the band that are on at the moment. I don't even know what they're called, but they're awesome. Yeah, yeah. yeah they're, they're amazing. Really they're really it's a culture, the culture scene in Glasgow and Edinburgh, um, quite strong. And like Stirling's a sort of middle ground, and people previously had to go to Glasgow and Edinburgh to get their sort of to listen to good bands and get together with all sort of like-minded people and I think like bringing something like that to a town like Stirling where there's already quite a tight-knit community anyway it's uh, it's bringing in more people and they get just people talking and it's good it's good for the development of sort of music and art and, and the sort of local community. I think the venue is quite cool like yeah. where it's kind of like Stirling's quite unique it's, and you never get to come to these places like me and Kat were saying as we're walking up that we've never been to the jail um, so it's cool to get a chance to come and like see it so. No, I think it's an, ex an excellent venue. I think I, I like the sort of the old setting and everything. It's really nice. I mean, yeah. and the fact that it used to be the old sort of tourist attraction thing, and they're actually putting it to, to better use now. Um, in my opinion, anyway. You might get some confused tourists. Though. Yeah, you might get some people wondering <laughs> that. Like. It's good doing it, and it promotes uh, music and someone's a good thing. about the filth guys coming to perform here. Uh, when is it guys? Tell us when it is. It's, uh, hopefully it's going to be May 26th and uh, we're going to have uh, electro bands playing on the stage. We're going to have a silent, silent disco. disco. Silent disco with two DJs battling each other and so that they, uh, they you know, we'll have a, maybe like a, maybe a techno artist and then we'll have a, like a, maybe a dubstep artist and then everyone gets to choose what, what they're going to be electro bands that are playing and then so everyone gets to choose what music they want to listen to and then we'll have bands on and, uh, and then the DJs play on afterwards and then we'll have an after party down in town and so it'll be basically from six o'clock uh, at night until three o'clock in the morning so we have a massive party fest yeah, awesome. I, I got one more thing before we go could everybody just shout as loud as you can creative sterling and we'll try and bust this <laughs>